I think it all started with our president, Peter Fagan, wrote a love letter to me before the game um, that made me chuckle. And so um, I you thought, shared that with the players. No, 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 no. I would never share that with the players. <laughs> Um, but it had a big heart and, uh, and it said, I love you. And I thought it was kind of funny and, and it kind of gave me a great idea that we needed to get back to having fun. Um, sometimes as a young team or a team, you know, you, at the halfway point, you might get a little tired and, uh, you know, losing doesn't help. You get a little frustrated. And I thought, you know, we have to smile. We hadn't been smiling of late and having fun with one another. And uh, I thought our president set the tone tonight. Guys were pressing, right? I mean, that, that was the yeah, thing. It can happen, you know, when you use the word pressing, but I think it's more or less, uh, you know, we're searching, trying to figure out how to get out of the hole. And uh, this league is, uh, is never easy, no matter who you play, no matter what the record is. And uh, you saw that today. We just took it quarter by quarter, and the guys did a great job. Well, you said that before the game, and you at least tied the first quarter. You had the lead, then won the second quarter. And what about Jabari, the way he came out? Uh, uh, he was very inspired. He was, he was great. Yeah, he's been great for us all season. You know, I thought he set the tone um, from the beginning all the way to the end. I thought his defense, and he, he was communicating throughout, you know, the whole game. And uh, we need that from him. And, uh, again, he set the tone, uh, helping us uh, defensively, coming up with some steals, rebounding the ball, and, and starting to break. But I think just the communication of everybody. I thought Moose was great. I thought our bench, again, uh, got better today. And uh, we, we talked about that before the game. Our bench has helped us win a lot of games this season. I thought they were good. Coach, I was going to ask you about that bench, but more specifically, Jason Terry coming up with three big steals in that fourth quarter. Just contributions, it seemed like, were coming from everyone in big-time moments. He was fresh. Um, uh, you know, I thought uh, his energy was high. Um, I think he's playing some of the best defense of his career for us. Uh, he came up with some steals, as you mentioned. But I thought his voice was loud uh, for the whole game. And again, that's a lot to do, uh, to be loud and be engaged, you know, for f over 40 games. And so I thought, again, him uh, taking advantage of not playing in Miami as much as he wanted to, I thought he was fresh and he, he gave us a big lift. Obviously, Miles gets the start tonight. What did you think of him uh, and kind of what he brought tonight? I thought he was great. I thought he was physical. I thought he finished. I thought he set the tone again early by setting screens and rolling. And then defensively, I thought he changed shots, you know, and that's what he's done for us in the past. I thought he was great. I thought it was a great build for him from the Orlando game. Um, I thought, again, he did a lot of good things for us in Orlando, and uh, he stepped up big, you know, in the starting position for us tonight. 16 assists for Malcolm and Delhi. What does it mean to you guys when you have both of them going on a night like tonight? Yeah, you know, you look at uh, the assist was it was high. We scored 68 points, I think, there in the first half. Uh, the ball was moving. Guys were making shots, uh, and I think we were taking the shots we wanted. You know, Houston can get you into a, a, a shooting contest, and we didn't fall for that, you know, this time around. We fell for it, I think, in Houston, but tonight we took our time. We got the ball in the paint, and we finished. I mean, you give up 114, you're never going to be happy with, with a number like that, but what do you think of the defensive effort tonight? I thought the defense was great. Um, we did give up 114, but I think we did the right thing in protecting the three-point line. Uh, they made some, um, but we didn't dis get discouraged when we gave up a layup, understanding they followed the game plan. So that falls on, on the coaches. We, we needed to you know, take away the three, and uh, I thought the guys did a really good job tonight with that. Was that a focus, trying to run them off the line? Uh, yes, with Houston, you got to keep them off the line. That's what they do. They shoot you know, 40 a game, so you got to be able to you know, guard the three. Jason, you guys made 11. I mean, if, if they made 14, but you made 11, you're going to like your chances. Yeah, you know, it's you know something that um, we've talked about. When Mirza plays, our threes go up automatically, even if he doesn't make any. Um, you know, he spreads the floor. That's what he does for us. And I thought he was, I thought he was good to, tonight, even though he didn't make a three. I thought his shots were great, and it's just a matter of time for one of those to go down for him.